Well, I want to state that I wasn't really paying attention much to what type of vitamin C I was taking because um, actually from what I read from the doctors um, that ascorbic acid is really what animals produce on their own in their body naturally. It's not anything different. Um, I do know that um, like the natural forms of vitamins in pretty much every case there's a there's a huge difference between how they work in um, the synthetic forms like for instance um, you know even lysopene lysopene um, that if you take the lysopene from a tomato they call it lycomato um, that's been known to have anti anti-cancerous effects especially like a prostate cancer but if you take the uh, synthetic form of like lysopene it's got zero effect and this also goes along with vitamin E and um, you're talking about vitamin B3 niacin nicotinic acid that's got a lot of benefits but when you're talking about synthetic forms the non-flushing type no uh, but I do know with vitamin C, and I know people have been hammering me saying, oh, you know, it's not the complete vitamin, but it's really ascorbic acid is really what the animals produce. Now, I was getting this because this is just from Wally World. Um, ascorbic acid with, um, ascorbic acid, that's really what it is, right? Uh, with rose hips. And I'm thinking, well, it's got a little bit of rose hips in it, fine. And it's a potent dose, and I'm taking 30,000 units of this a day, so I take 30. But, you know, one thing that got me was uh, product of China. Now, sometimes China does have good products, but I'm not really trusting anything distributed by Walmart stores from China, okay? I mean, China could make good products, but like, like I said, and I'll repeat it, if it's imported by Walmart made in China, I don't trust it. Now, this is Puritan's Pride, and um, I am i don't know where the product is actually made. It could be probably coming from China, but this company has been around a long time. It's the low, longest running online vitamin mail order company. It's been around since the 1940s. Um, they do have a quality control in the United States where they lab test everything. I don't know what Walmart does. I don't really care because I've decided to just get these. This is a little more money. But instead of just having rose hips, it has citrus bioflavonoids, uh, if you can read that, um, to aid and enhance the action of vitamin C to support blood circulation. It's a little more like what people have been criticizing me, that this has the um, the stuff that you would get naturally when you're eating fruit. So it has some of that in there besides just the plain ascorbic acid. Routine, routine, which is, I think this is from the actual peel of like the lemons and uh, lemons and oranges. Okay, the routine, hesp hesperidine, and it's an antioxidant properties, protect the brain from oxidized damage. You know, it, it, it all works together. Then it, this has the rose hips. The other Walmart brand, Spring Valley, had the rose hips. Acerola reduces signs of aging. Alfalfa, that's been, alfalfa you can take separately, but it's in there. Um, not much. I think it's like uh, one milligram per thousand gram dose, but it's, it's in there. You know, sometimes a little bit working together synergistically does a lot. And um, that's been known as an ancient medicine all the way back to oh, the Middle Eastern cultures. It's been, you know, predates even the Greeks and Romans, the alfalfa leaves and barley grasses, which contain carnitine, vitamins B1, T, B2, 12, iron, magnesium, amino acids, as important also some enzymes. And there's not much in there, but it's in there and it works synergistically together. Now, what I've been doing, though, that's unique is that I've been taking this and what I've done in addition is I've been doing at least a dozen hours or more of probably 16 hours or more of doing the blood electrification with the Beck style zapper now it's not to say I'm gonna tell you why I'm doing this is because and I'm not sure this might have the same effect because this has a 1 hertz, a 3.9 hertz, and a 4 hertz mode. 
The hertz is what causes the transfection combined with a certain amount of electricity with a square wave. I'm not sure if this will do it. It's, it might. This might work too. But I'm really, I know this does. I know this does. What I'm really using this a lot for is not so much to kill microbes, but to absorb, try to super absorb the nutrients. So I'm taking selenium, zinc, I don't know, there's uh, the trace elements, the NAC, um, you know, cod liver oil, fish oil, and all that with this, you know, and other vitamins. And of course, the Nature's Way Whole Food Alive Energizer vitamins, okay? with this to try to get them super absorbed into the body so and that's why I'm wearing these tens pad you can see there's one tens pad on my wrist and there's a tens pad on my opposite ankle under my boot <laughs> and under the, under the inside of my ankle and um, just runs all the time but that's a method I'm trying to do in addition to try to uh, super absorb this I'm theorizing it's gonna work like a lipsomol vitamin C even though I'm taking it just plain orally this might have that effect too. I'm not sure. I mean, I'm one person. I wish you know I could have 12 people try this out, 12 people try that out, and you know, or 100 people try this out, 100 people try this out, because this even has the one hertz, uh, which is the ideal uh, hertz frequency for tra uh, transfection. But this has about 10 volts positive offset DC, and this has. 30 volts AC so there's more of a variation and I'm, I, I don't know if that's if this is going to do the same as that I'm not sure it might it might be nice if it did because I'd rather be using this one to tell you the truth because <laughs> it's a little smaller it's got one battery and all that stuff plus you know it's got a few frequencies that can work but um, just remember that um, this this is probably not a bad choice and what I'm combining this with electronically might cause it to have a liposomal effect. I have seen online where there's electronic methods to cause vitamins to be absorbed as if they are liposomal uh, preparations versus just plain oral vitamins. I'm not sure if what I'm doing though is that. But I do know the transfection effect where vitamins and nutrients are super absorbed with this has been known for quite some time. As a matter of fact, Bob Beck said not to take vitamins while you're doing this. And I'm thinking, well, I don't think, well, I have my opinion on Bob Beck. I think he's throwing us some curveballs. So, um, I, you know, I'm doing, but I do know that since vitamin C really has no upper toxic limit, I'm not worried about you know, causing a transfection effect with vitamin C. So if the 30,000 becomes like the equivalent of 45,000 or 50,000, I don't know what it would do. I mean, I'm thinking it's not going to double, triple, or quadruple the effect. I think it's probably going to cause maybe, if I took a guess, okay, a guess, it seems like a good extra 10,000 seems to get absorbed when I'm doing this, taking plain oral vitamin C an extra 10,000 milligrams. So I'm assuming that's like taking 10,000 uh, uh, milligrams of liposomal. I'm assuming. I don't know. I mean, I, I can't only do so much as one person. I'm experimenting here. But I wanted to take a better form. At least it has this in it. This may not be the best, you know, vitamin C there is available but this does have a very high rating on their site uh, the vitamin C super C 1000 complex 1000 being for milligrams and um, I want to stay strong for working on my cars <laughs> Cooter's garage here right so anyway <laughs> anyway uh, so anyway that's that's a wrap and um, we're gonna be uh, talking about some other topics here pretty soon so I'll be dropping a few dimes and we shall see over now.